All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Bloodborne video. Last episode, we defeated Lady Maria of the Astral Clock Tower, and we held up the dial that dropped after we beat her, and it led us through the clock tower at the top of the Grand Cathedral, and we dropped down into the fishing hamlet. So, uh, I do also want to mention, if you were in the stream this morning, I don't know why I tried to switch games i tried to switch over to chivalry 2 from gundam evolution and for some reason streaming does not allow you to switch games while streaming so i i'm gonna have to look into that or i guess if if we're gonna play a game we just have to make sure that that's the game we want to play for the entirety of the stream so just want to make you guys aware of that this area is Filthy. Ooh. All right, here. Look at all of those guys. for the free blood echoes. I appreciate it. There's an item up there. Where... This is cool. I'm liking this area. We're just gonna run straight to this building. We'll go up top because there's a bomb thrower. Are you kidding? How do- What? How did I miss him with both of those heavy attacks? That was so strange. around wow dude he did so much damage to me that quick okay so we're in this building we have to get over I want to Okay, there's a secret, or not really a secret, but a ladder. You see this giant fish, dude? Look at this dude. I think, is this gonna let out to the item we saw? I heard him drop down behind me, don't worry about it. He was healthy. All right, nice. Harrowed garb. Oh shoot, wait a minute. Is this? Simon, that was all of Simon's. There's a bloodstone chunk, holy cow. That's a great find, that's what we needed. And say I'm sure somebody else is popping up right behind me. Okay, let's see how dangerous these guys are. Okay, 
Okay, that was extremely painful, so we're gonna need to kill whoever's doing that right away. Can he hurt his allies? Get me out of here. I, I just got comboed. We need to lessen the pack. There's so many of them here. Come on. You almost grabbed me there. I thought I dodged that one. Jeez. Kill me. How, dude? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, man. That freaking sucks. Cause now we got all that stuff to deal with still. Just literally fumbling the bag, running away. Couldn't finish anything off. That's nice, real nice. Freaking stupid. This guy doesn't even deal damage to anybody. So you just sit there and let him flop around. All right, let's try this again. Here we go. Out of here, are they fighting? There we go. We did it. Shoot.
Come on, we can finish this. Come on, finish. Don't die. Shoot him. Yes. Oh my gosh. Rakuyo. All right, so we've... We got the Rakuyo. We're going to take a look at this. In a second. There's fish dogs. There's dogfish. Look at all these guys, dude. How am I supposed to deal with this? We just gotta progress. I'm running. <laughs> okay. All right, we're going to take a look at this Rakuya real quick. We're going to have to use some Kin Cold Blood to repair our weapon, probably upgrade the Rakuya to check it out and cap our blood vials off. Uh, but with that, that's going to be it for the video. Let's read this real quick. Hunter weapon wielded by Lady Maria of the Astral Clock Tower. A trick sword originated by the same in the same country as the Kinhurst Chicago. Only this sword feeds not off blood, but instead demands great dexterity. Lady Maria was fond of this aspect of the Rakuyo as she frowned upon blood blades, despite being a distant relative of the queen. But one day she abandoned her beloved Rakuyo, casting it into the dark well when she could stomach its presence no longer. Alright, so we got the Rakuyo. That's going to be it for today. Next time, we will check out um, more of the fishing hamlet. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.